Hello, uh, this is Wanyang from Informatica Support, and uh, today we are going to talk about the uh, one of the uh, address doctor option, and uh, its name is a prefab script. Let's begin. Okay, uh, what is the, the prefab script option? The prefab script prefab script option is about um, yes, it determines the, the output character set of the, your AD validation result. And uh, it is for uh, very useful when we need to change the output character set of the AD validation. So it depends on the situation, and the output can be ASCII character set or the native character set. And uh, there's a, uh, any other options, also you can choose it. So, so and are we going to show you uh, how we can configure this value in the developer client the uh, developer client and uh, address checker address checker is our own uh, standalone utility for the address, address validation so let me go to the address checker first this is the address checker and uh, that side, you can see the non address from the Japan. And uh, as you can see, this one is a SK character set, it's an input. And uh, on the right side, you can see the Japanese character set as an output. So let me change it. Let me change it to the SK character. As you can see, this option is a people script option. And uh, let me change it to ASCII. Okay. And uh, click the parts. And uh, it gives us a C2 validation value. And as you can see, the output is become the ASCII. And now uh, let me revert back to the database. Actually, the database is the, the default, default value for this option. Uh, I change it. Uh, I click the validate button. You can see the button becomes the uh, Japanese character set. Okay. Now we, I want to show you how to how we can configure this one in the our developer client. This is the one uh, typical AD validation mapping. Okay. And uh, let me check the this one source file. This one is the source file. You can see the we I gave the same address to the input. Let me. I just want to show you how. And uh, if you click the address validation transformation. Go to properties. Go to advanced. If you scroll down a little bit, then you can see the reverse script option. Only is a database. So, as we expected, if I run the address validation transformation, it will give you the database character set. So let me go from the first. Okay. Uh, Continue name is Japan. And the match code is C2. And uh, if you go further, locality information is marked as the, the Japanese character set. Okay. Now, next time, let me change it, uh, this one to the ask. So it shows the 
SK characters in the output. the first continuous Japan is a C2 match cool both order so information becomes the yeah, ASCII character okay let's go back to the our point so uh, this is the values we can give the top is the options we can give database, author admin, and the right team. We can also give the ASCII. And then as you can see, the Japan, we can give the, if you, the database is the default value. So each character set, for the China, you can see the Chinese character set. For the Japan, you can see the Japanese character set for the default value. Default value is a database. You can change it to ASCII. And for, for these countries, you can see the output in the ASCII character. The thing is, not all countries are available for this preferred script option. Let's say the Korea, uh, we can still cannot support the database. I mean, the Korean, Korean character for the default option. So for the Korea, everything is uh, ASCII. The other countries, as you can see, we can only give the Latin. And now, uh, to sum up this presentation, so to uh, to find more information in the, the our support site, you can on what you can looking for the other software library document. This document also has more detailed information. Let me show you. As you can see, this one is a preferred script parameter. And uh, one the options you can get. Same information, same chart you can see in the next page. In the next page, you can see the options and uh, continues the same as the the that one show you I just paid for there's also KB article KB 1514.52 as the, the more detailed information about the uh, people's script people language and uh, I want to uh, Wrap up this this uh, presentation now, and uh, you can give the, the any other feedback from using our support mail and uh, our support Twitter. Thank you for listening.